basic urban delivery services in Brussels have not been affected by the pandemic. Um, everything continued to work, electricity, water, public transport, uh, the whole system functioned because we considered that public service are in essential services and so everybody continued to work in these services. The main challenge in the city of Brussels was to make sure that people have enough public space to go out because in some parts of the city people live in pretty dense areas in small apartments and they need to go out to sport to take some fresh air and um, that was the reason why we decided to make extra bike lanes to make extra squares car free and just simply to take uh, space away from the cars and give it back to the people what we also did is in some areas of the city we decided to lower the speed uh, limits from 30 kilometers an hour 50 kilometers an hour to 20 kilometers an hour so that uh, pedestrians and cyclists had priority uh, on the cars. That was uh, with one aim, to give more public space uh, to people. Second big challenge we had was make sure that the homeless people were getting uh, the attention they needed. It means food, medical care and also a home. And that's the reason why we decided to rent hotel uh, capacity in order to make sure that people without papers uh, or people who are just simply homeless could stay during the confinement period uh, of the lockdown in these uh, hotels, which anyway were empty because they are no longer tourists or businessmen coming to Brussels. There was a close cooperation with local communities and uh, public authorities on the food distribution, uh, distribution and also on the um, operation on giving shelter to homeless people and people without uh, legal uh, status in uh, Brussels. That were the two main areas where it was a very close cooperation. For the rest, of course, there is a everyday, normal-based uh, cooperation between the local communities and the public authorities in Brussels. Brussels doesn't know slums and so by consequence we didn't have these particular problems in our city. The only thing we had is in very dense areas to make sure that people had more public space, but we managed to do so.